Saturation diving is a method used in underwater diving that allows divers to work at great depths for extended periods of time. The technique involves divers living in a pressurized environment underwater where their bodies become saturated with the gases they breathe. This process helps to reduce the risk of decompression sickness when ascending to the surface. Saturation diving has been used in various industries such as offshore oil and gas exploration, marine salvage operations, and scientific research. However, there are limitations to saturation diving, including the time it takes for divers to return to the surface once their mission is complete. Additionally, the high pressures involved in saturation diving pose risks such as decompression sickness and oxygen toxicity. Saturation divers must undergo rigorous training and adhere to strict safety protocols to mitigate these dangers. By understanding the history, techniques, uses, limitations, and dangers of saturation diving, we can appreciate the incredible feats accomplished by these skilled underwater professionals. Saturation diving, a technique used in underwater diving, has a rich history dating back to the 1930s. It was developed to allow divers to work at great depths for extended periods without suffering from decompression sickness. The first commercial use of saturation diving was in the 1960s by the U.S. Navy and the offshore oil industry. Saturation diving involves divers living in a pressurized environment for days or weeks at a time, allowing them to work at depths that would be impossible with traditional diving methods. One of the key advantages of saturation diving is that it reduces the time needed for decompression, making it safer for divers to return to the surface. Over the years, advancements in technology have improved the safety and efficiency of saturation diving operations. Today, saturation diving is widely used in various industries, including offshore oil and gas, scientific research, and underwater construction. Saturation diving is a specialized diving technique that serves various important purposes. One key use of saturation diving is for offshore construction and maintenance of oil rigs and pipelines deep underwater. Saturation diving is also utilized in underwater welding and repair tasks that require precision and expertise. Scientific research and exploration benefit from saturation diving by enabling researchers to study marine life and underwater ecosystems up close. Another crucial application is in the field of marine salvage, where saturation divers can recover sunken ships and valuable cargo. In the military sector, saturation diving plays a role in submarine rescue operations and underwater demolition tasks. Overall, saturation diving is a vital tool in various industries that rely on underwater operations, ensuring successful and safe outcomes for complex projects. Saturation diving is a complex and high-risk method of underwater diving. One major limitation is the depth restriction, as saturation divers can only work at certain depths due to the extreme pressure. Another limitation is the duration of the dive, as divers must spend days or weeks in a pressurized environment, which can have negative effects on the body. Health risks such as decompression sickness, high-pressure nervous syndrome, and oxygen toxicity are also significant limitations of saturation diving. Emergency evacuation from a saturation diving system can be challenging and time-consuming, posing a serious limitation in case of unforeseen circumstances. Environmental conditions such as rough seas or severe weather can further limit the feasibility of saturation diving operations. Equipment failure or malfunction can also occur, adding another layer of risk and limitation to saturation diving. Overall, it's important to understand and respect the limitations of saturation diving to ensure the safety and well-being of divers involved in these challenging operations. Saturation diving is a high-risk method used in deep-sea diving operations. The main dangers of saturation diving is decompression sickness, also known as the bends. This occurs when helium bubbles form in the bloodstream due to pressure changes. Symptoms can range from joint pain and dizziness to more severe cases of paralysis and death. 
Extreme pressure at depth can also lead to oxygen toxicity, causing seizures and unconsciousness. Saturation divers are at risk of hyperbaric oxygen toxicity, which can have long-term effects on the central nervous system. Additionally, the confined living quarters and isolation can lead to psychological stress and fatigue. Emergency situations in saturation diving can be complex and challenging to manage due to the remote location and limited access to medical care. It is crucial for divers and industry professionals to be aware of these dangers and prioritize safety protocols to prevent accidents and injuries.